Hey everyone, hey everyone. This is Earth Angel, Goddess Oracle, back with another reading for the collectives. Welcome, welcome, welcome to all my new subscribers. Welcome. All right, so first thing first, you guys know I am not a tarot reader, I am a prophetess. I use cards just to connect with you guys, just to connect with the overall energy for the collectives in your person. Over here is a self love journey. We go through the world through. We take those lessons and create blessings out of everything we go through. I don't do person readings. I don't answer personal questions. I focus on the things you guys need to know, not want to know. So if you guys want what I offer, it's called a healer's corner's message. And that is a message from your spirit guides and your angels. Exactly what you need to hear. Not what you want to hear. So simply send me your name and date of birth. You can go on the community board to see how to receive a message from me. 1818 is a donation. Please follow the steps on the community board. Please allow 21 days for me to get back to you guys. Make sure you guys put it if it's a... Um, advice message or a Halo Queen's message in the subject block that you guys want to receive. Alright y'all, so y'all know I'm away in LA. I'm up here trying to get all these messages through. Y'all can go on the community board if you need any other additional information. If you want to purchase any of my, my spiritual inner healing candles, you guys go to the shop button on my page. My Instagram is Serene Naturals. It's S-E-R-E-N-E N-A-T-U-R-A-L-S underscore. The link is in the bio for my spiritual inner healing candles, okay? All right, so let me make this a little quickie quickie. I know, you know, I don't like these messages. I like to be live with y'all, but I gotta hurry up because I had a busy freaking week and I like to cram and do everything the last minute, y'all. I'm so tired, but I'm in LA, y'all. So, you know, I had to pre-record this stuff so you guys can have some. I may have to go live because I can't do all these things before. I'm tired as a motherfucker, okay? <laughs> so, um, I think I know what I'm going to do. I know what I'm going to. I'm gonna pre-record you guys for Monday. Just Monday. I'm just do Friday, Monday, Saturday, Sunday. I'm at the pop in. You hear me? Cause I'm sorry. All right. So let me. Um, I'm gonna do a weekend read. I'm gonna see what y'all weekend looking like. Okay, y'all. Let's see. What is Friday looking like for the collectives? Even though it's probably towards the end of Friday, y'all. Y'all know I still let y'all see what the week is looking like. Friday, family. Happiness. Oh, yes. So, Friday looked the fuck good. Okay, what's going on? Y'all gonna be with y'all family? Y'all gonna be happy as fuck? Like, you know what I'm saying? Some of y'all gonna be healing family relationships and stuff on motherfucking Friday. You understand? It looks good for y'all. Some of y'all healing family relationships. Y'all gonna be with y'all family just being happy. You could be with the kids. Y'all could be playing, getting some sun. Just I just see a good day on Friday. Or you could be dealing with family issues that you could be working on, healing and stuff. Um, some things could be coming out about a family situation for some. So be on the lookout for that too. Because I'm also seeing something that could be coming out, be exposed about a family situation on motherfucking Friday. So everything ain't everything. Alright? So let's look at Saturday. Mm. look at this Saturday is about balance look at this it's like you guys can be like something that you've been waiting on could be coming like balancing itself out so something that you could have been waiting on you guys you may get some good news about it something is going to work in your favor for some of you guys if you guys been working on something um you're going to get some good news about this as well too um you could be investing on your health or balancing things out in your life is what I'm seeing as well. So, yep, because I feel like you guys have been healing from betrayal. I'm just seeing some things working out for you, something that you could have been waiting for. I'm seeing the fruits of your labors growing and blossoming, and it's things working out in your favor. If you guys had invested in some type of commitment or legal situation, it's going to work out in your favor as well. So, I see some of y'all could be putting out money. You could be starting something you had to invest into, time and money, and that's just, it's going to be working out in your favor. This looks good for the weekend. What else, Spirit? For um Sunday. Yeah. Cause I feel like you're going to get justice. Something you've been waiting for is going is going, it's going, it's going to work out for you. I'm just going to let you know something's going to work in your motherfucking favor. All right, Sunday spirit. Oh, Sunday. There's somebody who is off balance because you not giving them no love. So there's somebody that could be off balance that you no longer waiting for. I feel like that that you no longer giving your love to. Yeah, you might get a message from them. You may also get an apology from somebody as well too. Might get a message, some type of apology. 
somebody who's been cold to you because they had a third party and they were toxic is yeah they 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 planned on holding back from you because <laughs> they was juggling and now they blocked stuck in a karmic cycle without no closure because you ain't talking to them so sunday it looks like somebody around your energy is gonna feel crazy all because you're not giving them no love mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. they're gonna be off balance all because you're not giving them no love and no fucking attention ain't that some shit uh -uh. All right, let's get some more information to see what this weekend looking like, y'all. Now, I forgot to tell y'all that I'm over our energy is air sign. Tuh. Now, that is not just about a sign because I know how to read sign. That's about that's a king of swords energy, y'all. That I'm picking up on. Somebody cold as a bitch. Somebody who's acting aloof. I don't know if you guys are gonna meet this person or encounter this person. For some of you guys, like I said, I see lawyer. Maybe for some, you have some type of law. A, a situation maybe this is a lawyer somebody who um can bring some type of justice for you to, to to work some things out you may be talking to somebody who's intelligent you understand who has some type of position a high authority position that can bring something to work out for you in your favor and for others somebody who just fucking cold as a bitch we know who that person is detached person somebody very detached and very cold i don't know if it's you i don't know if it's somebody around you but that's the overall energy of somebody and that type of authoritative energy cold tatch more logical not operating their emotions whoever this person is on sunday this is somebody who could, could have been married you understand if not they could be still or this is somebody who's resourceful somebody who may have a business or somebody who focused on their money that person is going to be off balance because you're not giving them love and that's on motherfucking um sunday so let's look on um friday let's see more information about friday you guys unexpected love mm. seeing some bs okay so mm. So, yeah, you guys could be, like I said, with your family, you could be healing, and you got somebody who is going to get some news about you, that love you, that don't want to love you, but love you. Something may be illuminated to somebody. Like I said, some things may come out in regards to a family situation, may be exposed. They may see something. Yeah, secret, yeah, something's going to be exposed drama for some for somebody and it could be a family situation being exposed or something with a family being exposed and like i said for some of y'all you with your family and shit um and maybe do something unexpected with your family and it's fun and it's exciting and somebody see you and they looking at and they want you more and like they feel like y'all belong together it's a lot of shit going on okay but i do see happiness for some of you guys some i see success with your family for some of y'all for others i see some a family situation being exposed um or somebody finding something out you being happy and somebody finding that out that you fucking happy without them but somebody realizing that they want to be with you and you make them happy you see what i'm saying but i see also a family situation having some healing too so spirit give me something on, on saturday for the collective getting close to you somebody's gonna try to find a way to get close to you so somebody's gonna be trying to invest into invest into you find a way to get close to you oh no not them trying now you, you be the fuck careful because the king of swords could be somebody strategic as fuck too because not them up here trying to figure out how they can invest and take you to bring some justice. And some of them is even thinking about how the fuck they can get close to you so they can get you fucking pregnant. Ain't no fucking way. Or even try to get themselves in the door so they can have a new beginning with you. They could just try to get close to you just so they can try to wiggle their way into your fucking life. Some of them's even thinking about how they can get close to you so that they can keep you in their life. And for some, they think about getting pregnant get you pregnant this is crazy their emotions is stupid right now they thinking real crazy they're just trying to figure out a way how they can keep you holding on to them but then it's like while they have another affair 
with other people. Oh, see, fuck that. Whoever the fuck this is is fucked up. They being strategic. How can I keep this person with me forever while I can still go ahead and do what I want to fucking do? Fuck them. I'm so upset. <laughs> I'm so mad. The, the, the audacity. Their thoughts is bringing them every fucking way. And it's like this person's going to do whatever it takes. Work hard to bring some type of justice. And they'll do anything. Wow, that's what this is about. Mm. Let's look on Sunday. Mm -mm -mm. Look, drama. It, well, it's, you know what? This person right now, I'm about to say imbalance. They causing, they're causing drama because they off balance. Because they simping on you. That makes no fucking sense. So they're going to be causing some type of drama with people because they're off balance over you. Right? With the people who they up here creating lies and illusions to. They selling dreams to. They're going to be causing dramas with them. Because they feel like you guys are finding love again. And you ain't talking to them. And they still stalking you. And now they don't want the people they with because they too easy to be with. They want, they like the chase. This person will use, possibly use children to manipulate you in the past. They could have. They would do that. Or they are. Mm. While they was with somebody else, they could have been doing it to you. While they was with someone else. This is just ridiculous. Oh, Jesus Christ. This weekend is goofy. All right. Let me get another card for um, Friday Spirit. Look at this. King, not, not the King of Swords and King of Swords. It's the same fucking card. Remember I told you, somebody trying to problem solve. They want happiness. They want to heal a connection. They trying to solve this issue that they fucking have because they feel like you guys belong to them. They're brainstorming. They're trying to figure out how they can be strategic. Karmic. They are fucking karmic, y'all. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. This is a karmic that's doing this. Yes, that wants to talk to you about their issues so they can come in towards you. Somebody who's been trying to copy you. They want to vent about whatever issues they got going on with you. Hoping they can come in after you after they vent. Okay. Well, give me a card for Saturday. Is they trying to think of all kinds of shit, y'all. They really are. Second, look, setting this record straight. They're trying to figure out how they can come in to come in and tell you some things. Or how they fucking feel. Like how, what they can do. What can they say. But they feel like they it, it's somebody who you dealt with for so long, though. That person's depressed. This is all about this person's feelings and what's going on with them. I don't know what's going on. With, besides, y'all could be with your family happy as fuck. Like I said, investing into something. Something you're investing into is balancing itself out. So I'm looking at the positive shit here for y'all. But this person all up and through your energy. I think you've been dealing with... You invested so much into this person for so long. It's like this is old. This is old to you. Spirit, give me a message for Sunday. Riding it out. Mm-mm-mm. mm, -mm. mm, -mm, -mm. <sighs> Karmic. <sighs> so sad. This is a fucking karmic. This is somebody who... They was definitely staying with a karmic. Staying with a... This is somebody who stayed, decided to choose to stay with a fucking karmic. And now they got drama. Simping on while they simping on you, imbalance as fuck, cause of their own fucking choices. Child, this weekend is crazy. This is somebody who's being strategic. This person's up here trying to figure out how to solve their problem, which is you. Okay. Becoming very cold to other people, and and that's cause and they're causing their own drama for the weekend. All right, spirit, give me a warning for the weekend for the collectives. What's that about, spirit? <laughs> okay, so did not tell you this person's off balance. Whoever um they could be married to or they could have gave a ring to, 
whoever that person is starting drama with them. I don't feel like that's a warning for you. I mean, you do need to know this person's still promiscuous. Been acting like they've been happy, but this person got money issues and they be out here having drunk sex and things being revealed. That's going to destroy their life about them not using protection. Oh, that's the warning. So, yeah, yeah, things... Look, remember I said y'all family situation going to be revealed? Things is being revealed about this person. Karma is playing in this person's life for real, okay? And looks like from a karmic who's starting some drama with them as well, too. Or they, you know, they could have started drama with you. Or they having drama with now. This is somebody who they gave a different proposal to. Not to you. Someone else that they gave a proposal to, they're going to have drama with for this weekend. And I really feel like... And then this is... They're promiscuous. So, I mean, maybe you need to know that for whatever reason. Leave this person alone. This person's being strategic, y'all. Should they even thinking about apologizing to your ass, too. For being cold and being with third parties, for being toxic. This person is going to do whatever. <laughs> I'm just trying to let you fucking know. They're thinking about all different types of ways to get close to you. And what the fuck you would want to hear. And what the they should fucking do. Okay. All right, let me get y'all oracle for this weekend. Other than that, I can see y'all having a good time for this weekend. I feel like y'all gonna be good. Look, it's good shit for y'all. You guys is up here pulling your love back from this person. Ain't giving motherfuckers love. Investing in yourself. Balance. A lot of balanced days for you for Saturday. Family fun and shit. I mean, family healing family situations for some of y'all. But, you know, this person got the negative part. Whoever's on the other, the other spectrum. Some family situation being exposed. You understand? For some, it's a lot of shit going on here, so Y'all gotta let me know what's going on this weekend for y'all. Because it's a lot. Well, what position y'all played in this. And remember, energy is cool. This could play out next week and or it could be in the future. We all on different timelines. I just focus on currency. So this is happening for a lot of you guys now. Not everybody. So let me get an oracle to close out for the collectors. compassion be gentle with yourself forgiveness will set you free see the light in yourself and others and i feel like that's so important forgiveness is gonna set you guys free it's so hard to probably forgive this person go all oh, the crazy shit they did to you but forgiveness is going to set you free it's going to get out of your mental space it's going to get out your heart space it's going to make you feel so much lighter so spirit say number one have compassion for yourself because a lot of y'all be hard on yourselves and even to have compassion for this person because you know at the end of the day, who has the last say? God do. So I ain't going to rip you a whole asshole because karma beating your ass already. Why would I do that? I'm not the one with the last say, so I'm going to continue to live my life. I'm going to forgive you so I don't hold on to that, harboring that, and blocking my blessings. And I'm going to keep it fucking pushing. Look, then I say? And free yourself. That's basically saying trust. Trust the universe. Take free yourself and go into a different direction, spirit is saying. Yep, look, towards abundance. And that's how we gonna fucking end that here. Because that's where the fuck you guys are going when you guys have compassion and forgive. For you, not for nobody else. Alright, y'all. I love you guys so much, y'all. So see you guys soon. Bye, you guys.